welcome to Gold Harbor. We're very lucky to be here today after a recent snowfall. And the snowfall has accentuated the beautiful layering in these metamorphic rocks. And if you look off toward the Endeavor, the mountain to the right of the Endeavor there shows wonderful metamorphic layering, which is folded and faulted some 150 million years ago, showing this beautiful ribbing, if you will, or the cartilage of the Earth. And off on the other side, we can see the hanging glacier, which spectacularly shows the bluish color and wonderful coloration of this densely crystallized ice. Not a great sound. He's just waking up, but there, there's a good bunch of uh, sub-adult elephant seal males here. We're at the end, complete end of the breeding season, but a lot of these animals have not mated. They're too young. The big animals have left the beaches. But all the jousting that you're seeing here is is part of the uh, part of establishing territories, but we're really at the end of the mating season here, so more play behavior than anything else. And I'm always amazed at the at the postures that these large seals can assume. They're able to bend their their back, to assume a banana shape, and and you don't see that in any other seals but the elephant seals. So all of this trying to get higher than the other guy, the one that is higher, you, wins the battle, and you can see it going on right there. They're just trying to get their nose up above. And even the nose structure itself, from which these animals get their name, elephant seal, the nose itself is just another appendage which gives that visual impression that the animal is bigger than the other. It's very important in establishing male dominance. In the steep foothills of Gold Harbor, we found the light-mantled Sooty Albatross. 